Anyone in the plasmid business ultimately requires the use of human test subjects. It's our dirty little secret. And to be frank, Rapture doesn't really want to know, provided the end product is sound. The volunteers were scarce, even as the economy buckled. A man named Sinclair approached us with a seemingly limitless supply. He uh, rented them to us, bound and sedated. No questions asked. Delta. One little jab in the arm and even a hopeless underperformer can be employee of the month. Or oh, you should know. Look around. Is any of this familiar? The Rapture consumer is indebted to you, my boy. We ironed kink after kink out of our domestic plasmid line on you right here. Well, let's see if you're staying competitive. Step on up and take the spotlight! Ladies and gentlemen, Fontaine Futuristics invites you to shed your skepticism, evolve your expectations, and dissolve your doubt as we unveil the revolutionary power of our home defense plasmid series. Have a volunteer from the audience. Come now, don't be shy. How about you, sir? No, he's positively rigid. Yuma, at the back. Oh, come on down. Let's give it a hand, folks. Volunteer? Oh, come now, gentlemen. She'll be awfully nervous up here all alone.
subject Delta. It looks like you've upstaged a fellow demonstrator, and he's here to steal the show. What will Delta do now, folks? Without you, and to think you were so spliced you couldn't stand when we stuffed you into that getup. The Fontaine family retirement plan suits you to a T, my boy. In subordination, severance package benefits, benefits rescinded. I, I. <laughs> Prison, it seems, was a blessing. Brian is now dead by his own son's hand. But far more interesting is the program of compulsion bred into his child, coded W-Y-K. It was some manner of verbal trigger phrase, which the boy would obey as an order, unerringly. In a way, this sad thing, this harp. Agnes Day. Access granted. Welcome, Gil Alexander. Hello again. I must assume by now that you're willing to help end my life. In exchange, I have prepared a friendly security escort for you. Ah, now, uh, there's a switch in here which will allow you access to the real laboratories where, where what's left of me awaits you. Please, use it.
As I recall from my time doing business with the owners, that Oxyfill station out there is just a front for a kind of hidden passage leading down below. If Lamb's hiding Eleanor from you, that's where she'll be. I'm afraid the lights in here sting my eyes terribly now. Until you arrive to deal with me, they will remain off. Please, locate the breakers and flip them, and then return here to restore power. shall be spread evenly across the entire human race. For me, that is discipline at great personal cost. For him, at last, it will be instinct. Sophia believes the perfect human altruist is just a formula waiting on us to solve for X. Intelligence and consciousness are not the same, she argued. Sophia and I knew that to create the first true utopian would come at a high cost, my friend. We needed someone to be host to all that Adam, Rapture's finest minds, a willing subject, that is to say, myself. Whatever you may have seen inside the tank, that was indeed me. I fear the fate of Eleanor Lamb will be less physical, but no less grotesque. This tank for deep sea life is the ideal way to dispose of me. But first, you must retrieve enough adam-infused plant life to lure me out. The slugs feed on the stuff, and it's all I seem to want now. I have left a sample here, so you know what to look for. Delta? You want to be top man? You want to sit in the big chair? Well, come and take it!
listen, son, those override keys you've been hunting are genetically encoded. And to get to Eleanor, you're gonna need one from Alex the Great in there. First things first, we gotta pin him down, find those plants he mentioned, and lure him back out. the end of the Alpha series. The pair bond simply worked too well. That mad woman Tannenbaum bit the company hand, turning some of the bonded sisters human again. Others were lost to splices. Either way, the trauma proved too much for the bonded protectors, resulting in unreasoning rage or coma. We can harness their suicidal aggression as foot soldiers, but no more, I'm afraid. Today I saw one kneeling near a gatherer's garden and crying. We can't have you running around the laboratories in your condition. Marching around, playing daddy, until some splicer manages to kill off their sister. And then, if the coma doesn't take them, they turn maniac. Nothing left to do but scream. Uh, no offense intended, son. We better get you to Eleanor, on the double. Your body begins to tear itself apart. The compulsion to find Eleanor will drive you to madness or coma. You have no claim on her. Your design was among Rapture's greatest sins. And yet, you persist. Why? Be with us soon enough. A simple death on death.
She was not meant to have a father, Delta. She was to be an heir to my life's work. And this is where they changed her, bonding her to you. The child she was died in this room. Sport. Time to feed the fish. Head on back to Alexander's tank and put those plants in. his will to die, Delta. To serve the majority by protecting them from his lunacy. Your entire journey here is based on your refusal to do the same. Will you grant his request, knowing that he served the family? Rebirth, huh? Sure, you live forever, but minus your body. I like my body, kid. I don't feature the idea of my memories and personality being stored in the head of some saintly child, like just one more dusty old book in the library. <laughs> Yeah. 
shall I do? Buy me out with this... this bribe! What is this? Sublime! God damn you, Gata! Ah, <laughs> perfect, son. You reel them in. Now, use that console there to take a gene sample. It should print up a genetic key automatically. You got the key to Lamb's hideout sport. Eleanor's down there. Now just head out to the Oxyfill station and use it. <laughs> 